Chloe, lovely to see you. Thank Bit you. Bit nice this, isn't it? Yeah, February sunshine, can't complain. How is it in camp? Because it looks lovely. The training pictures are nice, the sun's out, but this ain't holiday, right? Yeah, exactly. We're here to work and it's great to be back on the on the pitch with the girls and in some sunshine, even better. So first camp of 2024. How would you sum up 2023? I think England. a very positive, uh, very positive year for us. The World Cup was uh, everything and more than what we expected, and I think we see it as a real positive. We went to Australia and we made that our home, and we felt really welcome within the country. And I think it's to be getting to a World Cup final after winning the Euros is success for us. And of course, you want want to go on and win that tournament, but I think it's a it's a massive game for us to reach a World Cup final and. I think now we're here, we focus on what's next. It's not one of those things that sort of niggles away at you, you kind of come to terms and moved on or sort of look back fondly. How do you sort of look back on it? Yeah, it's definitely, it makes you hungry for more success. I think being so close and knowing what it feels like to have that success of the Euros is very exciting, I think, for everyone to want more. You're so positive. I love that. It's so positive. Obviously, look, the end of this international year didn't quite go. You got so close to the Nations League finals as well. So close. Was it that kind of like positivity? You're just like, you know, it's fine. That's in the past. We move on. I think it just, it, it's exciting that we can turn the next chapter and we're on a new journey now of, with our focuses. We're in 2024 and we look ahead now to what's next. And of course, the Euros next year is really exciting for us all. Talk to me about you in your form. I asked Gareth Taylor, your coach, a few weeks ago, whether you are playing the best football of your career. And he was like, you're playing really well, kind of, you know, everyone can get better. But are you playing the best football of your career? Uh, I think there's definitely still more to come from me. I think that's what's exciting as a player. I think you can never be uh, too positive of how, you, how you're doing because I think you're always, you can always improve. And that's what I'm hungry to do. I'm hungry to learn and I'm hungry to improve. And I think that's what's so exciting because... I want to be successful in my career and um, I think to always want to learn and want to improve and apply yourself in the way that you should. I think it's really exciting for any player to see what you can do more in your career. And I think, of course, that means titles for me. But you're seeing the fruits of that application right now, aren't you? Fruits of that application, is that a phrase? It is now. Um, by the fact that, look, you know, you're playing really well. City are playing really well. Huge wins recently as well against big rivals. Does it kind of feel like it's all coming together? Yeah, of course. I think there's still a lot of football to play in this season, but we're feeling good in this moment and the environment's great that we're in. So it's a real positive for everyone involved. And it's just an enjoyable place to be right now. And I think our focus now turns to international football, which is, is great to be back involved in this setup. And I think everyone's just grateful to be on camp and excited to be on the pitch. Come, You look like you're enjoying it. Yeah, of course. How could you not? I think to wear this badge is an absolute honour and always grateful to put on this badge. Talk to me. Actually, do you know what? Don't talk to me. Tell me about the fact that you are engaged. Congratulations. I haven't seen you since you properly. Much. Like, amazing. Thank you. Um, how, first off, how did it feel? And how does it feel to, like, you know, you enjoying being engaged? Yeah, of course. Nothing really changes for me except for a nice ring, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I think, yeah, I think it's amazing feeling and it was so special and yeah wedding planning's going well now i'm gonna tell you something i probably shouldn't tell you i was at a game a couple of weeks ago and i got talking to millie bright who obviously recently got engaged as well and i was like oh you know you've got your plans in in order she was like oh, i'm not chloe chloe's <laughs> all over it uh, so you know are you sort of you know are you all over it big book big folder yeah i'm really enjoying it i've got a little book and i i just enjoy it i just um I go home from training, it's a nice uh, switch off to focus on wedding planning and it's just enjoyable for me. Uh, I'd like to be a wedding planner when I finish playing. <laughs> You're good at it? I'm good at it so far. Not really stressful. Not stressful? No, I don't get stress. I like that. I appreciate that. That helps on the pitch. Yeah, of course. Good definitely. Look, it is great to see you so happy. It's great to see you smiling. It's great to see you falling out on that pitch as well. Thank you. I, I've seen you go through ups and downs seeing you go through the injuries, seeing you go through everything, to see you now back out there playing your best and smiling, it's great to see. Thank you very much. I think it's all about riding, riding the waves and enjoying the journey because, of course, everyone's journey is different, but enjoy, enjoy the journey because it flies by.
Cheers, Chloe. Thank you very much.